Hello everybody and welcome to a new Unity tutorial. Today I'm going to be talking about how to make a pause button and a pause menu. So what is a pause button? It's simply I've just made a example, it's just a scrolling background. Okay, it's simply when a game is running, you when you click the pause button, everything in the game stops. And we're gonna do a resume button as well. So let's get started. Now, first, we'll create a UI panel, and you'll automatically create a canvas and invest system. We'll just make this a bit smaller. You can do any size you like, but I just like it like this, and the color a bit dark. Okay, now we'll add a text, UI text, just written paused and put this up here okay next we'll create a button within the panel like right click on the panel and cl click UI button we're gonna call this our resume button okay now when we've done this you just see a button here let's change the text drop down here text resume Sorry, resume game. Now, we'll make another button within the canvas. So, this time, right click on the canvas button called pause button. Okay, and let's just change the text to pause and get to the top of here. Make sure you select the pause button, not only the text, and make the anchor top left because we're at the top left. Okay, now um, if you click on the buttons, let's run the games, see if they're good. Now, when you click on the buttons, nothing will happen because you're not at a script or any actions, they're just normal buttons, they do nothing. Okay, now you'll have to make a new C sharp script, we'll call it pause menu okay in this pause menu script let's open it up in mono develop we do not need void update or void start so just select all that now we'll make a public game object uh, we need the pause menu and like a comma um, pause button this is just simply what it's gonna write at the side um, oh these two are the same we'll just call it pause menu by a smaller because these two cannot be the same the name of the project and any name of a game object or any flow you're making now we're gonna write a public void and is gonna be pause okay in here what we it's a very very simple script time dot time scale time dot time scale is equal to zero so when you click the pause button everything in your game will just stop we'll make another one just copy this and put it down here public void resume and make this time scale to 1 which is the normal speed of your game ok now let's save this come back here it might take a while to compile down there and ok now you have to go to your canvas like when you click on the canvas you can just let it just compile down there. ok now when you click on the canvas add component pause menu pause menu okay we add this it says pause menu of the object and pause button our panel um, let me just read that pause menu like our panel is going to be the pause menu okay go to our canvas drag the panel into the pause menu and our 
pause button into the pause button game object place okay now it does nothing we have to go to our pause menu and in here this is spread out for all the places we'll just right middle okay on our pause button we have a list empty which is on click we click the little pause down here drag the canvas down to the object and there's no function click on your pause menu this is our pause button so we'll click pause and for our resume button we'll do the same get the canvas and drag it into here and in the no function we'll just do resume okay we've done that let's see if it works and the background is going to be going normally and when we click this pause button it should pause the game there everything is stopped when you click resume the background starts scrolling let's just make our background a bit faster so we actually realize it stops click the pause button resume everything working fine but we do not want our pause button just to be up all the time and interrupting our game so get the pause menu off over here and okay that's off so you do not see it but if you just click the pause button now let's do it okay when you just click the pause bu button nothing will just come up it'll just pause the game and you cannot resume it and let it just play okay you just paused you cannot resume you cannot do anything we have to go back to our pause menu script and here we'll have to add the menus so we've called it the pause menu up, up here it's called the pause menu so pause menu make sure it's the same one you've written there dot set active is true like when public void uh, pauses of it is like true the pause menu will be shown and we want we don't we not want to click our pause button a lot of times so write pause button dot set active is false so you cannot click on the pause button a lot of times okay now just all you have to do in the resume just copy paste this get it down here and just um, make these the opposite make the pause menu set active false when we resume the game so the pause menu gets away and you can click on the pause button again okay it's as simple as that now let's go try it let it finish compiling down there and when we should when we click on the pause button the game will pause and it will show up the menu and when we click resume game the game should go back on and it should be background scrolling and the pause menu will go away okay let's click play see if this, everything's working well you always have to check it step by step because you don't want to do all the code and get it wrong at the end okay now when we click this pause button it just show up there we go the pause button is unavailable and when you click resume game the pause button is back and everything's just working fine thank you for watching this tutorial and we will be back for more unity 5 tutorials